Hey, this is Gary from 3Bug Media, and today we're gonna to talk about video marketing and why you as a small business owner should be doing it. It's a fact that video marketing is the fastest growing marketing medium online. It's growing faster than traditional blogging, podcasting, infographics, images, things like that. And video takes up the majority of internet traffic today. Now, while most marketers, brands, corporations are jumping into video marketing with both feet, the fact is small business owners, local business owners are not doing video marketing at all. And if they're doing it, they're doing it poorly. So I wanna give you a couple of reasons why you should be doing it and a couple ideas of how you could be implementing video marketing as part of your marketing program. Number one, consumers. 60% of consumers prefer video over TV. The vast majority of people consume internet traffic, internet things via their phone today, and video is the number one thing that they consume. And most people prefer to watch videos on their phone than to actually sit down and watch TV today. Number two, 72% of people would rather learn about a product or service from a business via a video than any other format. So people are very receptive to learning about business, learning about products, uh, services, things like that, via video than other formats. Audience, people who watch video tend not to read blogs or listen to podcasts. And I had this fear as someone who does video marketing, blogging, uh, sometimes I do podcasting as well. I always had a fear that I was going to kind of oversaturate my audience by, you know, making a video and then blogging about it or doing a podcast on the same topic. And I actually learned this from some other marketers, some bigger marketers that had really big audiences. And they told me that if you made a Venn diagram with your video audience, your uh, blogging audience and your podcast audience, they would almost not even, they would barely touch each other. Most people who consume video only consume video. Most people who read tend to only read. They usually go with their preferred learning style. So if you're doing video marketing, you're actually tapping into an entirely new audience. Number three, easy. It's easier and faster than blogging. And I can tell you that firsthand. The time it takes me to create this video, if I were to create a blog post on it, it would take me about five to 10 times as long. But by the time I finish writing it, formatting it, getting all those things together and publishing it, shooting a video is way easier. The reason why most people don't do video is fear of being in front of a camera. And I can tell you that's a real fear because I had that as well. But I can tell you after 15, 20 times of getting in front of a camera and speaking, you start to get more comfortable with it. And the other fact is when you're doing video, it doesn't mean you need to be standing in front of the camera talking. There's lots of other different video formats. Just look at social media. The vast majority of video on social media are not somebody standing in front of the camera speaking to you. Okay. And lastly, competition, less competition than blogging. So even though video is exploding, there's still less competition today on YouTube and other marketing video channels than there are on, you know, Google trying to compete, you know, against written content. So if you're trying to do a blog post, you're gonna have a much harder time ranking that blog post than you are trying to rank a video. And like I said, when it comes to local marketing, small business, you have almost no competition. So what are some things we can do with video marketing? Number one, educate your customers. Customers want to learn more. You probably have a lot of interesting things to teach potential customers, whether you're a financial planner, uh, pest control, anything like that. Take Everything you have, break it into bite-sized chunks and make short little educational videos. People will really enjoy it. Testimonial videos, social proof. So you probably have a lot of testimonials on different websites, on Yelp, on Google. Take some of them, turn them into a testimonial video. You can make a collage and you just basically use a text slideshow and make a video for it. Great way to turn you know, those testimonials, get more value of them, out of them by making a video. And if you have willing participants participant customers, you can record them giving a testimonial as well. Let people learn about your business. People want to learn about your business. They want to see how it works. They want to see the people behind the business. Give them kind of a backroom tour of what your business is like. How do you make your product? How do you, you know, deliver your service? Uh, about your team members that people may not see. 
things like that. Let them learn more about your business. And lastly, entertain your customers. So there's probably ways you can do it. Uh, you know, you see it all the time online. Businesses will make funny videos with their staff, or they'll do it with, you know, if you're a vet clinic, I just saw one where the staff sang a song, you know, things like that. Figure out ways to entertain your customer. So there's lots of things you can do with video. There's literally hundreds of ideas you can do. Really, it comes down to getting started and getting over yourself with that fear of video marketing, getting in front of a camera and just getting started. So if you want to learn more about video marketing, online marketing in general, you can go to 3bugmedia.com. Thank you very much and have a good day.